Sporothrix shankii is a fungus. It's found worldwide all over the environment, present in soil as well as on living and decomposing plant material. This organism is a dimorphic fungus. In fact, it's thermally dimorphic. In the environment, it is found growing as hyphae, while as in host tissue, it is found as a yeast. The transition from hyphal to yeast forms is temperature dependent, and that's why we call it thermally dimorphic. It can exist in two forms. So, environment, it is in the hyphae form. In host tissue, in humans, it is in its yeast form. Examiners note a cigar-shaped yeast. Kind of a unique description right there for you. So the disease that sporothrix causes is sporotrichosis. It's commonly referred to as Rose Gardner's disease because it exists on vegetation and plant life and is introduced into the host by trauma to the skin. It's frequently seen in gardeners, florists, people frequently around these forms of vegetation. So when spores are traumatically introduced into the skin frequently by a thorn, this can cause a local pustule or ulcer to form with nodules along draining lymphatics, which is commonly referred to as ascending lymphangitis. In the immunocompromised Disseminated disease is possible. Disseminated meaning the disease can spread throughout the body. Lastly, how do we treat sporotrichosis? We can treat it with itraconazole or potassium iodide. References and works cited along with additional information can always be found in the YouTube description. Thanks.